，身材高挑嘅黄天涯 Helen 曾经系一名空姐。喺一次飞行当中，佢帮助咗一位外国旅客。佢就系从加拿大海明顿去新疆乌鲁木齐建设苗圃嘅 John。当时我在飞机上算是。可以承担跟外籍旅客交流任务的唯一的乘务员，就这样我们认识了。因为我是当时区域服务员，所以他就对我的印象很深。She shared with us that her husband wanted a divorce, and Helen was very emotionally upset. That opened up the door for us to to share the gospel, to share with her that you know she could. Come to the Lord Jesus. That you know, if she believes in Him and she accepts it. 经过一年嘅准备，二零一二年天涯终于留学加拿大，带俾 John 同埋 Cindy 一个大惊喜。他每个礼拜早晨，从嗯九点钟左右吧，从 Dundas 很远的地方开车要反过来接我，然后再经过 Dundas 到另外一个还要离 Dundas 二十五分钟路程的地方去，到教会崇拜。也帮我认识了不少新人朋友，然后也对我就是最初的这种融入奠定了基础。同时，天涯好喜欢参加华人教会嘅聚会，认识咗好多朋友，对神嘅爱亦都有更多嘅认识。但系孤单嘅生活始终对佢嘅情绪带嚟好大嘅影响。你跟周围的老外，貌似友好的老外，你们不可能建立非常深刻的友谊。嗯，再加上想念孩子，我就开始。我开始怀疑我的这个行程，我觉得我怀疑我的选择，我认为我做了一个很失败、很可笑的一个举动。我在那一刻觉得我承受不了，我也无法解决我生活中的难题。我必须有一只大手，或者是一个比我高很多的人拉着我站起来。我就找到曼丽，我就去他们家。我讲完以后舒服多了，曼丽一直在耐心的听。她问我说。你要跟跟你一起祷告吗？我说要。好，嗯，祷告完了以后，我说我要觉知。就在那一天，一月十五号那天，他带着我觉知了。Then I received a text from from Helen saying that she believed in Jesus and that she had accepted him as her Lord and Savior. And I was just, wow, I can't believe this. <laughs> this is wonderful. Yeah. yeah. And so, and then I. I texted her back, and, and I, I said something like, "You know, now you are my sister in Christ." And she thought that really kind of it was a new way of thinking. You know, really. 信主之后，天涯学习依靠神，生命开始慢慢改变。同年，神亦都带领佢嘅仔瑞德顺利咁获得签证，嚟到海明顿同佢团聚。把儿子带过来了以后，一下面临了很多困难。孩子的上学，然后还有一些生活上的，呃，琐碎的事，买车、生活、吃饭，种种的压力，让我觉得，嗯，我需要用祷告来让主知道我我的呼求，嗯，我就跪地祷告，在神的面前，我就觉得内心有一个大大的熨斗，把我的心熨平了，我就不再感到焦虑、烦躁。因为我可以把那些用来苦恼的时间，去做一些具体的事情，比如说我坐在那儿整理一些我的课业，替孩子整理作业，把事情变得具体了，就没有空泛的烦恼了。我觉得他性格变得更好了，就是嗯，更开朗，做什么事都很淡定，会先祷告，然后再去做，所以我觉得这个是他一个很大的进步。天涯不单止变得独立坚强。因为耶稣基督嘅爱，佢亦都学识去付出爱。他用各种方式去，诶、呃，做点吃的，或者是到了节假日的时候给我们买东西。其实我都很不忍，因为他跟儿子两个人都在这是留学，要花很多钱，他又没有工作，但是他却给我们大家在节日的时候买一份礼物，我就很感动。我知道，其实他也是被神。去爱人，深深的感动，知道怎么去爱神、爱人。We were blessed by it.、Yeah. Just it wasn't just one way; it was both ways. We were yeah. also, yeah, yeah. you know, very blessed by it. I think it also had an impact on our family yeah. and our children. Yeah, absolutely. It They was a testimony to our whole family. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, I still remember. You know, I'll get 
Father's Day cards and from Michelle that would say, oh dad, you know, how you reach out to people in, uh, you know, even in China and that. So there, it would definitely had an impact on our, on our, on our children as well. 现在就是完全把自己交付给神，他是一个非常值得信靠的、很实实在在的神，无处不在、无时不在。所以我就想，我你要说未来的规划，我就好好想尽心服侍他，嗯，让我的孩子能够平安、健康、快乐的成长，让他在这么大的文化跨越里不出心理或身体方面的问题。而我自己有一个非常好的精神面貌能展示在人前，我觉得这也是为神做的一个很好的见证，很好的一个服饰。